Yes. This is the boy bunny. One more time. And I just want to send a big shout out to the old Jamaica and the world. And as I said, if it's the first time on this channel, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. So, what I want to do right now, I want to give a big, big shout out. As I said, I always leave a shout out to each and every person in Jamaica who share the news first on for we in the UK. Because when we watch the normal news, sometimes we don't get the news straight the way we, it come from YouTuber. So what I do, I literally tune into the YouTube channel and get the news from the YouTuber who send out the news to us in the UK and around the world. So at the moment, I want to say especially a big shout out to My Views TV. Because as I said, My View TV I like how they present the news and in the UK, for we who watch it in the UK, we know that we get in the news first on. Well, I'm getting the news first on. And, you know, as I said, I just want to say a big, big shout out to My Views TV. And if you live in the UK, or America or anywhere around the world and you never hear of my views TV go and look them up they give the Jamaica news and I love to watch the Jamaica news because Jamaica is my parish and I because of them I manage to keep up with what's going on in Jamaica so big up my views TV every time yeah, so next person I want to big up is Dan Sal Skiller. Big up Dan Sal Skiller, who also present the Jamaica news. And the way how he present it, and as I said, just the same. I love to watch this channel because it brings the news to me in the UK and other people around the world. And as a Jamaican, by getting the news from them, it helped me to keep in touch with my country and what taking place in my country. I know most of the news they are sad news, but at least I managed to keep up with what's going on in Jamaica. It's sad to hear about the goat thief in, 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 in St. Thomas because I am a St. Thomas man and it's not nice to know that these people raise their goat and when they reach the stage where they're supposed to be earning something from it other people just come and just pack them up in a car and just take them and go on with them. So I big up the citizen who catch them and I big up the police them for them wonderful works. But you know, for the driver who say that he is the driver, them hire him to go to St. Thomas from Bolivia. Yes, he probably thought in the truth that they hire him because they could they hire him for go and do the job. But I would say from the moment he get there and realize what was going on. You should have drive away and leave them. You shouldn't get involved in it. So, you know, bad luck for him dropping this situation. Yeah, so let's move on. And I said, big up to Dance Art Skiller. And I would say, keep on doing what you like doing. 
and to every other YouTuber who present the news that we can get it in the UK. A big respect to, to you. So keep presenting the news. I will keep on watching you a lot in the UK as you're sending news to me. Because as I said, as I subscribe to you on a channel, as soon as your news pop up, my phone pling, and I know that there's a news from Jamaica. And that's how I get them first on. Because I subscribe to your channel, and as soon as you put it up, my phone pling, and then I go and watch it. So that's how I keep up with what's going on in Jamaica. You know? Yeah, so big up to the Jamaican YouTuber who present news from Jamaica. And to every other person who present other program, big up to you also. You know? And also I wanna say to my Jamaican brothers and sisters out there and other people around the world who disrespecting the COVID, I will forever beg you lot to remember that COVID kill. A lot of people die from COVID and COVID don't respect none of us. So Donald Trump there, eh? You never think he would have catch it, but then I'll try catch it. So who are we? We think that we're not going to catch it. So I'm appealing to each and every person in the UK, in Jamaica, in America, Canada, wherever you are in the world, to respect the people around you. Respect yourself. Let's protect our one another from this COVID because the only way we can protect one another is by wearing a mask and regular sanitize and wash our hand. As I said, you go into the supermarket and into the shops and you see people in there, no mask. And worst when you're in the supermarket and you're going down the aisle and you see three, four people bungle up in the aisle and they don't have on a mask and you know you have on your mask and you have to walk past them. Now imagine if everybody was to be like that and one person sneezing at that aisle and you have to walk through it, you inhaling in all of that and you coming out with something. You're going home to your wife, your girlfriend or whoever it is at home and think you're all right because you just went to the shop or you pick up something and carry back home. So you just trying to protect yourself and the other people out there not doing the same. You walk in the shop, don't tell the very person who's serving you. No mask. So I'm begging, I'm begging, I'm begging each and every individual person. If you're using public transport, wear a mask. If you're going to the shop, wear a mask. And also, as soon as you come out of the shop, make sure you have your sanitizer. Sanitize your hand. Good, sanitize it. You get into your car, sanitize the steering wheel and your gear stick, you drive home. As soon as you get home, wash your hand before you do anything. This is the only way we're gonna stay safe from this COVID. And that don't mean that we're safe because we just never know, but we have to try our best. These people who are having parties and groupies and these things, it's not good. We thought COVID be gone are coming to the end when everything comes down and the government said we can do things. The government never mean we can go there and go have party and go to beaches and go on holidays and do all of these things. It's irresponsible. But we just go like we have no cares in the world. And look what happened. 
the death rate start to go up, the hospital start to fill up back, and people is just getting sick. So as I'm saying, I am appealing, I'm using my social media platform to beg of each and every individual out there who believe that they will never catch COVID. Are they not gonna catch COVID? I have a friend who get COVID. End up in a hospital for like how many weeks? String up. I have my niece. I have more than one friends who catch COVID. So I'm not saying that I'm free from COVID, but I'm trying my best by wearing my mask in public and wash my hand regular. In my work van, I have a backlash sanitizer. In my car, I have a backlash sanitizer. And in my bag that I carry around with me, also sanitizer. So I'm begging, 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 begging each and every one. Don't leave the sanitizer. Make it number one in your daily life as your food. Without it, no. I'm not going to go out without it. And I want you to say the same thing. I am not going to leave my house without my sanitizer. Remember that. Keep it in your head. I am not going to leave my house without my sanitizer. I don't leave my house without my mobile. So let that be just the same. So everything you touch out there, sanitize. Come home, wash your hands. In the shop, my mask. In the public, my mask. Let us seriously, seriously, seriously take COVID serious and see if we can bring it back down together and get rid of it completely. It's only me, you, you, and you, and you, and you can do it. The government can't do nothing. The government can only instruct us. But unless we hear and do the right thing and allow this thing to go, we will forever have in debt rate and lockdown. So I'm appealing again to each and every everyone to Listen, obey, do the right thing, and allow COVID to go. This is your boy Bunny appealing to you a lot. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to share, to like, comment, subscribe, and leave, leave your feedback. But it that notification bell that you don't miss a video that goes up. This is your boy Bunny appealing to you again about this COVID. Do the right thing. Your boy Bunny in and out. Peace and love.